Welcome to Gear Info Tech. The content for today is the all new Bajaj Pulsar N150. And now Bajaj has finally launched a scary product. Yes, why I'm saying this? Just because of this front profile. The front profile, as you can see, it's quite scary. Yes, if we specifically talk about the headlamp setup, it offers you a nice projector headlamp setup right here in the center, which gives a very nice and bright light. The DRLs right here, two DRLs, very nicely done. The piano black finish right over here, some piano black finish here also, surrounded by the headlamp setup, of course. Again, a very nice look. The side turn indicators, the placing is quite nice and the side turn indicators are being protected by the handlebars itself because the placing is good. Nice number plate space right here. Telescopic suspensions right in the front. Mud flap is also quite good. The bike is available in two color options, white and red. This is the white color option and the other one is the red color option. The bike offers you ABS single channel and disc brake, single disc brake. If you talk about the tire size, the tire size is on your screen right now. And now let's talk about the side profile. The side dimensions are right on your screen. Now, if I talk about the fuel tank, the fuel tank is somewhat around 14 liters. It offers a pulsar barging on the fuel tank with some graphic work. It is an oil cooled engine. Now talking about the engine, it is a 150cc of engine which produces somewhat around 14 PS of power and 13 mm of peak torque. The bike also supports a kick start. Foot rest. Paddle brake. It offers a drum brake for the rear wheel. Nice silencer. Long seat. N150 badging right here. Again some graphic work. So now let's talk about the OAVM setup right here. As you can see, they are quite aerodynamically designed OAVMs. And of course, it's a Bajaj product and also belongs to the Pulsar family. Nice handlebars right here. Sight and indicators on. Headlights, labeling options. Engine kill option. To start the vehicle. And this is how the bike looks when it hits the ignition. Nice fuel tank. Long seat again, you can see. Tail lamps right here. Side turn indicators again. reflector so now let's talk about the riding comfort of pulsar n150 right here now if i talk about the riding comfort the bike is quite comfortable the seat is very comfortable seriously as compared to other bajaj pulsars and even one thing i noticed a short person short headed person can also ride this bike so yes that's a quite very impressive thing what i would say the bike is quite aerodynamically designed again another thing another very plus point so it will definitely increase the mileage and also help to gain some speed there is a usb charger which i missed out right here that's also a very nice thing done by bajaj over here which is a very nice thing again now specifically talking about the handlebars over here they are not that wide but they will definitely provide you stability so this bike is comfortable and suitable for cities and for highways. But I would recommend you that don't take it for off-roading. It is not built for that. 